Welcome back, guys. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back again, guys. All right, so I'm going to do a quick money spread for you guys so we can take a look at our finances and see what changes, if there's changes that we need to make, if there's financial abundance coming our way, if we're stuck, what we need to do. So let's hop into it, okay? Um, if you're new to my channel, go ahead and click that bell to subscribe, 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 hit the like button on your way in, guys. Like, 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 like. Um, leave a comment below, okay, if this message resonated for you. If you want to book your very own personal career or money reading, you can do that in the, um, the information for you is in the description box below, all right? So let's get into it. Let's let's do this, okay? Oh, I am running a special, guys, for um, my readings. All that information is in the description box below. Check that out. All right, so let's look at our money and our finances and let's see what we can do. Or is there anything that needs to be changed? What message do you have for my subscribers, for my viewers? What messages do you have in regards to finances and career? Finances and career. All right, I'm going to do a three-part spread. First card is going to be the past energy for your finances, present energy, and the third card is going to be for future energy. Okay, so let's do it. What messages do you have? All right, the first card we have is the Eight of Wands. Okay, so it looks like things were flowing. Like money was just flowing. It looks like a lot of you guys may have been celebrating. All right, maybe drinking and partying a little bit, smoking a little bit, having a little bit of fun. All right, let's see what future energy is. Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio's energy. Okay. All right, very compassionate, loving, caring energy. Maybe some of you guys have been coming together in groups, inviting friends over, just having a good time. But I'm seeing a flow of, uh, I'm seeing a flow. Like Eight of Wands is most definitely a flow. For some of you guys, this may be a windfall of money coming through. This may be, some of you may be dealing with, um, you know, uh, communication, like communicating, consultants, um, talking with friends or talking to people and, and you're um, finding ways to uh, keep that money flowing in. I'm getting like there's lots of talk of talks like around a circle of people, a group of people. Um, I'm just getting it. And I'm getting like the energy for Queen of Cups energy is very, you know, loving. Like you're feeling loved. You're feeling very like loved. I'm, I'm digging this energy. I'm digging this. Okay, give me something here with the Eight of Wands. Yeah, see, some of you guys are feeling very in control. Okay, some of you may be um, communicating, conversing back and forth with a boss or maybe conversing back and forth with someone older. Maybe there's a sugar daddy. I'm going to put that out there, too. Maybe some of you guys, you know, are having conversations with older men, older women. Um, but I'm just getting like there is definitely boss type energy some of you have started your own business or want to start your own business maybe you're talking to someone older who's possibly done this already and you're trying to get advice i'm getting that advice as well too some of you may be going into like consulting being a, being a consultant why is the emperor here aries is energy okay some of you may be talking to an aries It's communicating with an older person. The Justice card. Wow. Libra's energy. And see, look at this. Some of you was being very hesitant on whether or not you want to make a certain move in career or money. But you're happy that you did. Okay. And I see that some of you are celebrating that you made some type of move. That you made some type of move. Because once you made this move... Once you made this move, you things started to change. Things started to shift, okay? And I feel like you have balance. Some of you may 
be uh, talking or discussing things with a Libra. I'm getting that there's, you know, a balance or talking about your accounts. Some of you um, are dealing with Cash App, PayPal, Zelle. Um, I'm getting like account, account. Why is the justice card here? Three of Swords in reverse. Some of you are trying to heal from something too. Some of you may be, uh, I'm getting credit as well too, like bad credit. Some of you may be talking to, trying to get your credit fixed. I see that as well. Yeah, looking for someone to fix your credit. Okay, so maybe some of you are discussing or talking to friends, asking people, do you know someone who could work on my credit, who could fix my credit because I'm trying to get my credit score, this is that. Right now is the time for me, you know, what with, with all everything that we got going on right now. Having a good credit score would be fabulous or to work on your credit would be a great, this would be definitely a great time. So I'm seeing a conversation amongst a circle of people. Maybe you guys have started a group chat. I'm getting a group chat too. Okay, yeah, see, friends that are on the same page. With this with this temperance card, this is a group of people in on the same page, okay? On the same page. I'm getting, well, let's see why temperance is here. Ooh. I'm getting a group of friends. Some of you are getting together with a group, okay? And maybe I'm getting to, like, listening to each other's ideas. We got the Ace of Swords. The Nine of Wands and the Judgment, Three of Pentacles. Yeah, I feel like some of you guys are getting together and coming up with ideas with a group of people. Okay, why is the Temperance card here? Ooh. Okay, some people aren't. Everyone's not going to be on board or everyone is not on board because some people feel like they don't want to take a risk. They don't want to take that leap. Let's see. Why is the Ten of Swords and the Fool here? Somebody doesn't want to take a, a risk. Maybe possibly signing some paperwork. Um, or some people just don't like the idea of something. So everybody's not going to be on board with this. Why is the Fool card here? If you're waiting for everybody to get on the same page, I don't feel like everyone is going to be on the same page. Yeah, somebody, you guys could be waiting to see what someone is going to say. Um, could be a male involved, king of pentacles, okay? So maybe you're waiting to hear about, you know, finances, about the money, about who's going to invest. This king of pentacles is um, someone who's very financially secure and stable. Page of Wands, okay, yeah, Ten of Pentacles, look at that. You're waiting for someone to um, offer some type of settlement or money. You're waiting to see what someone is going to say because I feel like um, some people aren't aren't okay with taking a risk and it could be because they don't agree with the rules or they don't agree with the contract or something in that nature. So it looks like some of you guys may be waiting to see what someone is going to say as far as investing, Okay, so we got Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio's energy for future energy. The lovers reverse could be a Gemini. Okay, so, okay. I feel like. You don't want to make, okay, so you don't want to make the wrong decision about, or, okay, you don't want to make the wrong decision, okay, so it looks like some of you guys are going to be closing a chapter on something um, and moving on from something. Some of you are possibly going to be uh, leaving a job or leaving uh, a circle behind because you guys may don't have the same ideas. You guys don't look at things the same. So you're going to go venture off and do something on your own. Why is the Six of Swords here? We got the world and the Six of Swords here. So that's definitely a closure. Okay, yes. You don't want to regret, okay, moving forward. Chariot is Cancer's energy either. And someone here doesn't want to rush. Someone here is thinking about long term with the Queen of Pentacles. How is this going to affect me long term? Um, you're trying to make sure that you're completely stable. You don't want to rush to make a decision, okay? Yeah, see, look, 
the six of cups and the four of wands yeah you're trying to be stable and look at this nine of pentacles you're trying to be stable you don't want to make any you don't want to rush into anything um you want to make sure that you don't regret this decision so some of you are you know are going to be wrapping up or closing a chapter on something and moving on to something new okay with that chariot card like you're going to be moving forward to something else that better suits you why well, is a chariot card here yeah. I feel like some of you are tired of something, okay? You're tired of not getting something. Some of you are tired of not being heard. Um, or I feel like it's some of you I just feel left out or tired of being um, like you're not being heard, okay? Some of you want to see some, some type of changes and maybe you feel like people aren't listening to you and you some of you are just becoming impatient with with that okay some of you have been very very sweet loving nice and now you're ready for something i feel like some of you are going to be starting um new partnerships okay i'm getting there's new connections coming in and that's something that's going to be good for you with this sun card something like a bright future future i feel like you guys are leaving something behind and starting something new for some of you there's a new contract okay there's a new um a new something uh a new agreement okay there's a new offer okay knight of cups so some of you are going to be going with something different, okay? Some of you are switching it up, switching things up. All right, so let's ask the angels on how they feel, how they do this. Message, please give me a message. All right, well, two came out. All right, some of you guys are trying to recover, um, are trying to recover from possibly finance, financial loss, or everything that's been going on with the pandemic, okay? And I feel like it's something here about perfect timing. Like something is the perfect time to do something. It looks like something is coming to fruition. Ooh, ooh. Something is coming to fruition within the next few months, okay? And we got you're ready, okay? And we also have abundance, all right? And we also have within the next few weeks. All right, so let me get one more card. Something about perfect timing. Thank you. All right, so we got wait because there's something better. And I got that for your future energy. I feel like a new opportunity is going to present itself and it's going to bring about big, happy changes for you. Okay, and I feel like some of you guys for future energy are reconsidering something else. And I did get that. Okay, so I feel like you guys are recovering from something in the past. Like you're trying to recover. You're trying to recover from something in the past. Okay, yeah. The hermit card. Ugh. Yeah. This is definitely trying to recover. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Some of you <laughs> just want something new. And some of you been wanting to walk away. For a lot of you, it's about... A, a job that you've been wanting to leave anyway, but you may didn't know, you know, how you were going to do it or how you were going to survive or how you was going to get things done. So you might have stayed. Okay. So let's look at perfect timing. Ooh, okay. The world. Okay. So it's something here about waiting for someone to say something. Okay. Waiting for someone to say to take this risk or take a leap of faith. Okay. Why is the world card here? <laughs> closing the chapter on you know the worries the troubles okay yeah you're waiting to hear something you're waiting to hear something hear something back okay six of wands empress 
I feel like some of you guys, um, I feel like some of you guys was waiting on an opportunity, okay? You've been hearing about what's been going on, Five of Wands. There could have been a lot of uh, disputes going on outside. You may hear about this on the news. The world could be the news. Um, I feel like you're listening to the news or you're hearing about what every, everything that's going on on the Internet. Um, and, you're, you, you know, some of you are losing patience, okay? But I feel like with this Empress card here, this is about abundance. The Empress card is very much so abundant. Like, she's all about producing and abundance, okay? And having that it factor. Like, everybody wants to be the Empress in the tarot, okay? But we got weight here for future energy. We got weight here. Yeah, Knight of Pentacles. Think this through clearly, okay? You don't want to make the wrong choice. You don't want to make the wrong choice. Watch your friends. Watch people that are close to you, okay? Because some people are really, really going through a really hard time right now, okay? Five of Pentacles. So you never know. You got to, it's something about here about watch uh, the people around you, okay? Watch the people around you. Something about analyze everything because you don't want to make the wrong decision. Looking at everything carefully to not make the wrong decision. Ooh, okay. <laughs> oh, some of you are getting a new home. Some of you are looking for a new home. Okay, some of you are house hunting. Some of you are starting a business. Some of you are looking for a new business front, like a, a building, an office. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> okay. See, yes, I'm getting investors. And some of you may have, you know, were worried about not having enough. I got the Page of Wands, the Queen of Wands, Ten of Pentacles, and the Five of Pentacles. That's about not having enough financial financially. So maybe some of you have been asking for grants, asking for assistance from friends, okay? From people with the three of cups to start something to get the get a, to get this going, okay? You're taking a risk. Okay? Wow. Okay. I feel like let me see about the four of wands. Some of you are getting a new home, getting a new business for your a new building for your business. Some of you are getting grants, loans. Ooh, look at this. All right. <laughs> we got the hangman and the sun card. So you've been waiting for this. You've been waiting for this. Okay, so this is something that's going to make you extremely happy. I feel like for a lot of you guys, this is a new business. This is a new home. This is a, a, a new building for your business. I feel like this is great. You don't want to make the wrong decision, okay? So some of you guys are going to be tr trying to wait and analyze everything before you make that big leap. Wow! Congratulations, guys. Congrats, 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 all right? I hope this message resonated. This was a beautiful read. I hope this message resonated for who it needed to resonate it for or with. If you want to book your very own personal reading, guys, that information is going to be in the drop box below. If you would like to donate to my channel, that information is going to be in the drop box below, too. And I hope to see you guys soon. Ciao.